Sonyville has been on fire the entire 2022, releasing some revolutionary plugins. And they're closing the year in style, releasing Pure Limit, a simple, efficient, and great sounding new limiter that you can also use on single tracks. Let's take a look at it. Hello everyone, welcome back to Mix Plus TV. I hope you're having a great day. Before we start, please check the info box down below for my mixing courses on Pro Mix Academy, free plugins, special discounts and offers. And of course, if you really wanna learn how to mix and master professionally, click the join button down here, become a Mix Plus TV member, access the already big and always growing library of full mixing courses, start to finish, mastering courses on many different genres and a lot more. And keep an eye out for the new live mixing classes. Those are a one-off. And if the videos are helping you, please consider using the super thanks and support the channel. Let's get to the video. This is gonna be a quick video because Pure Limit is as simple as it gets, but a great limiter nonetheless. Smart Limit Little Brother look like this when you open it. You need to press this green button to have it analyze your material and give you a first suggested setting. It has, like all the other Sonyville plugins, a list of genres here. In this case, I'm gonna start with Rock, press the button and play the song. few seconds and the plugin analyzes the material. In this case, it gave us a 7.7 .7, uh, dB of boost with very conservative limiting on it. If we take a look at the peak reduction here, you can see here in the graphic, there's a representation of how much we are limited, not a precise number. So this is more a feel and hear how it sounds as opposed to a count numbers kind of plugin. Other than your threshold, you have only two controls. The styles, we have neutral, hard, and soft and inflate, which is a saturation that increase the perceived loudness without increasing the nominal level. Always, always welcome. And I wanna say this one sound pretty good. Let's try on this track. Even at the highest settings, it sounds pretty good. I don't hear any audible distortion. Let's push it a little more and try to change style. It's very cool. If you look at the gain reduction graphic, the orange lines at the top, you will clearly see the change in aggression and how faster the release is because the downward transient gets more pointy. Take a look at this part here. I'll make it bigger. So you can see right now we are in neutral and if I click hard, it gets more pointy, soft. You see the release. It keeps the material limited for longer. I go back to neutral and these will become thinner, right? And then hard, even more thin. And this of course is a visual representation of what's, what's happening among other things. The release is faster, so you get more aggression. I use limiters in mixing on single tracks and groups. So let's give it a try, for example, on drums. We'll work on this extremely dynamic vocal here. Let's use the universal algorithm to compute I guess I kinda like the way you help me escape Now the day bleeds into nightfall We got 10 dB of boost, let me compensate here with the volume Into nightfall and you're not here to get me through it all Let my guard down into nightfall That's pretty impressive, clean as a whistle this is the neutral style. Let's try the soft. Into nightfall, and you're not here to get me through it all. Let's try hard. Into nightfall, and you're not here to get me through it all. That is really nice. I love the soft for vocal or the neutral. W with and without, this is without. Into nightfall, and you're not here to get me through it all. Wow, that's pretty impressive with Into nightfall and you're not here to get me through it all. Let my that is really nice, really nice. This is gonna also be great for rap vocals to give you that consistency and that in your face sound 
with a clean dynamic processor like this, and then you can color with, let's say, a blue face 1176. I'm gonna try the hard style here. And y'all be drip dropping in Gucci tops and Louboutins, New Balenciagas, Louboutins. I'm still rocking Fubu hoodies with some Puma socks like it's 92 and I'm popping locking on boulevards. Man, fuck a Medgar Hoover cops. Fucking losers, watch me write these bars in Google Docs. Then spot me copping glocks and hopping. I gotta be honest, I was uh, expecting for the hard to win, but, but I prefer neutral and most likely I would use the inflate to just add a little life to it. And y'all be drip dropping in Gucci tops and Louboutins, New Balenciagas, Louboutins. I'm still rocking Fubu hoodies with some Puma socks like it's 92 and I'm popping locking on boulevards. That modern steady sound in your face, I noticed the inflate tend to bring up a little warmth. But in some cases, like in this case, for example, which we could correct easily with Smart EQ, we go vocal low in this case. Man, fuck a Medgar Hoover cops. Fucking losers, watch me write these bars in Google Docs. Then spot me copping glocks and hopping out of Uber cars to pop so many rugas off these goobers won't know who to call. And when they get blasted with the chrome, the blood splatters in a pattern like fucking endless out the dome. Ah, carry. Really cool, super easy to use. I wanna test it on bass and drum really quick before calling a day. You notice the different release on the three styles. You can quickly recognize which one is better also because there are only three. I love hard in this case for the bass. A really cool plugin, let's try drums. Well, nothing bad to say about this plugin. It's clean, transparent, efficient, easy to use, and I will finally replace the ancient plugin that I default when I need a little bit of limiting on single tracks with this one. And this is it for this video. If you liked it, please don't forget to leave a like, comment down below, let me know what you think. The link to Pure Limit is gonna be in the info box. And again, if the videos are helping you or you wanna give us a Christmas present, use the super thanks and support the channel. Thank you for watching, subscribe if you haven't already. Stay safe, see you next time.